Hi, my name is Nicole Cook and I'm the Assistant Director of Kellogg Community College's Financial Aid Office. In this video orientation, we'll cover the most important topics you'll need to know about financial aid. If you have questions regarding your financial aid account, stop by the Financial Aid Office in the Hub Enrollment Center on KCC's North Avenue campus in Battle Creek or give us a call at 269-965-4123. We'll start by discussing the free application for federal student aid, also known as the FAFSA. The FAFSA is a form used by colleges and the government to determine a student's eligibility for receiving financial aid. Student loans that can be used to pay for college expenses like tuition, textbooks, transportation, or living expenses. If you have not yet completed the FAFSA, here are some key reasons why it may be beneficial to do so. First, you may be eligible for free federal or state funding, like the Federal Pell Grant or the Tuition Incentive Program. And, secondly, some external scholarship opportunities may require that you have a FAFSA on file. Additionally, if you're a dependent, you may still be eligible to receive federal student loans regardless of your parents' or legal guardian's income. To complete the FAFSA, visit fafsa.ed.gov. You or, if you're a dependent, you and a legal guardian will need to create an FSA ID and password to log in and sign your FAFSA at the end. Current students may complete the FAFSA now for the current academic year. For students attending KCC next year, next year's FAFSA will be available October 1st. Here are some key tips for filling out your FAFSA. First, both you and your parent or legal guardian will need separate email addresses. Second, do not use your high school email address if you have one, as this will be deactivated when you graduate. Use a personal email address such as Gmail. And third, write down your password. It is very difficult to retrieve your password if you've forgotten your security questions. Once you've submitted your FAFSA to KCC's financial aid office, check your KCC email account for notifications. You may be selected for FAFSA verification, which may require additional documentation. To access your verification requirements, log into KCC's Bruin portal using your KCC ID and password and click on the Financial Aid Self-Service link. There, you'll be able to view and print what our office needs to process and award your financial aid. Once your account has been verified, you'll be able to view your award letter through the Financial Aid Self-Service link and sign in. Visit our financial aid website at kellogg.edu forward slash financial hyphen aid for key dates, including loan disbursement dates. If your financial aid exceeds the outstanding balance owed to the college, you may charge your books and supplies to your financial aid balance at KCC's on-campus Bruin bookstore prior to the start of class. And if you have financial aid left over after tuition fees, books, and supplies are paid for, you will receive a refund check after the disbursement of your federal aid. To apply for student loans, visit KCC's financial aid website at kellogg.edu forward slash financial hyphen aid where you can find several forms and instructions. Once on site, you can download our fall and spring loan request form to complete and return to our office for processing. After classes start, maintaining your financial aid eligibility is fairly simple. Just show up. Attending class and receiving a minimum C average grade or better will ensure your financial aid awards stay on your account. Remember, if you drop a class after the drop and add date, the class is considered a withdrawal and will count as a class attempted but not passed. Our office checks your attendance and progress throughout and at the end of each semester. If you are not attending class, we may have to reduce your federal aid for that semester. Unsatisfactory academic progress or too many attempted but unpassed classes can lead to financial aid suspension and you will have to explain to college officials in detail the circumstances that led to the suspension in order to have that suspension lifted. To keep you informed and up to date on the financial aid processes at KCC, we've provided you with a KCC financial aid quick reference guide which includes all topics discussed in this video and more. Good luck and go Bruins!